What business had the Bradshaws to talk of death at my party? A young man had killed himself, and they talked of it at my party. The Bradshaws talked of death. He had killed himself, but how? They went on living. I would have to go back. The rooms were still crowded. People kept on coming. They. All day I'd been thinking of Burton, of Peter, of Sally. They would grow old. A thing there was that mattered. A thing wreathed about with chatter, defaced, obscured in my own life. Let drop every day in corruption, lies, and chatter. Death was defiance. Death was an attempt to communicate. There was an embrace in death. Then there was the terror, the overwhelming incapacity, one's parents giving it into one's hands, this life to be lived to the end, to be walked with serenely. There was in the depths of my heart an awful fear. Even now, quite often, if Richard had not been there reading the Times so that she, I could crouch like a bird and gradually revive, send roaring up that immeasurable delight, rubbing stick to stick, one thing with another, I must have perished. But that young man, he had killed himself. It was due to Richard, I had never been so happy. Oh, the days at Burton, when they were all talking, I would go to look at the sky, or seen it between people's shoulders at dinner, seen it in London when I could not sleep. Oh, but how surprising. In the room opposite, the old lady stared straight at me. She was going to bed. She was going to bed in the opposite room. It was fascinating to watch her moving about, that old lady, crossing the room, coming to the window. Can she see me? It was fascinating, with people still laughing and shouting in the drawing room, to watch that old woman quite quietly going to bed. She pulled the blind now. The clock began striking. The young man had killed himself, but I do not pity him. With the clock striking the hour, one, two, three, I do not pity him. With all this going on, I must go back to them. But what an extraordinary night. I feel somehow very like him, the young man who had killed himself. I felt glad that he had done it, thrown it away. The clock was striking. I feel the beauty now and the fun, but I must go back. I must assemble. I must find Sally and Peter.